I am super psyched for Detroit Become Human. The last playthrough was really fun. Hopefully you guys really enjoyed that recap. I had fun making it and I think I'm gonna make more recaps in the future. Cyberlife, the company that manufactured me, is conducting a user survey. A user survey? Would you like to participate? No, leave me alone. I just want to play. All right, happy New Year's, guys. I have just dropped a episode for a gaming channel, like a gaming clan called Relic Gaming. You guys need to like check the description and look at that because I did all the editing and it, it's about Call of Duty. So if you love video games, check that out. You want to see some of my work? Check that out. All right, where are we? Reboot. Damn, we're just hopping straight into the action here. This is an android that does not look so good. This is a new guy, huh? Ooh, I look like a killer, bro. Ooh, I'm gonna kill everything. I know what choices I'm making here. I'm gonna kill everything I see. Let's diagnose this. What are we looking at? What the hell? You're diagnosing yourself? One of those robots, huh? Am I unstable? Corrupted mind palace? Impaired vision. Am I in hell? Android hell? Is this what this is? Replace legs. I feel like this is that Metal Gear thing where you're like crawling in that oven. Has anyone played Metal Gear 4? It's like the worst mission ever. You're just struggling. This is exactly that, yo. Oh, that's one leg. All I need is one more. Compatible. <laughs> Time to upgrade my systems. My audio's messed up. I actually hear it. That's pretty cool. Let's put that other other leg right in. <laughs> Just like surgery. Fetch compatible left. Oh, what? I thought that was both legs. Okay. All right. Is this? This is Marcus. Oh no! What did they do to you, Marcus? Marcus, my boy. They tried to destroy him. And he survived, cause Marcus, Marcus don't take no for an answer, bro. Marcus don't take. I'm trying not to hit the mic. <laughs> Yo, where am I, bro? <laughs> it's up junkyard. Okay, thanks. Thanks for answering the question, game. Now nah, hold up, I gotta get out of here as soon as possible. Yo, this is... bro. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Yeah. Find Jericho. Bruh, I don't live here. I don't know who Jericho is. <laughs> Find Jericho. This is type scary. Who knew that I would leave the playthrough in such a weird spot? That when I come back, bro, this this feels like hell. And I think that's what the game's trying to say. This feels like hell, bro. It's like all these dead bodies that weren't supposed Where to make it. Telling you, I like this game. There's a lot of artistic choices here. The lighting is all dark. This is just like hell. Like the Lost Souls. <laughs> I like it, I like it. Replace damaged parts, find optical unit. And I still have that, but it's all red. Ah, it's disrupted. Okay. Incompatible. <laughs> nice. I need to find an optical unit. Please, give me my eye, bro. Can you hook me up with an eye, brother? Yeah, let me take it. Oh, nah. I have to, bro. Wait, what? No. Nah, I actually wanted to kill you. I'm sorry, you're lucky. I pressed the wrong button, you're lucky. <laughs> what the hell is that? What, the other side? Oh, the eye, right? Please give me an eye. It's hard days at the junkyard. Can you give me an eye? I just want an eye. I don't care about you. Like, if I have an eye, I could probably like examine where everything else is. I think I need a heart. Because if I don't get my heart back, your boy's good as dead. I don't want to look. Try climbing. Bro, I need a heart. 
Yeah, I need I need some type of part. I don't want to just walk out empty-handed. I feel like I'm at the Apple store. I gotta, I gotta... Yeah, let me get that. I gotta take advantage of what's here before the iOS Heart 10 comes out. Put that in, boy. Remove. Oh, nah. How am I gonna survive? Really? This is a trick question, yo. Sure it's locked and there we go my heart is beating okay i think we're good now i think i think we're good we just need an eye if, if i walk out with an eye i'm gonna feel like a brand new man didn't i look at this guy already oh give me that audio processor yeah i want to hear the real sounds i want the binaural beats up in here I want to hear what's behind me in 7D, bro. Let's put that on. That's my MP3 plug, boy. Alright, what are we listening to? Oh no, all I hear is Dead Mouse. Take this out, please. Yeah, you see? I told you guys. I told you guys. They're making this based on like hell. So I guess I can follow me bro. Okay, so now I hear exactly what I'm supposed to do. Please what, bro? What do you want me to do? End it. Oh, <laughs> don't mind if I do. I'll kill you. I'll kill you if you ask. You probably have an eye I could take too. Oh, damn. That's all it takes? You twist the belly button and he's dead? Oh, damn. Look, he asked for it. I don't even feel bad. Can I get your parts? He's telling me I killed you, but I can't get your parts. Anyone else want to die here? I, I got a service going on. Uh, do you have an eye? Yes! Yes, boy. You should have never opened your eyes, buddy. That's it. That's it, boy. Oh, nah. <laughs> really? Shit, me that hard to get out of this. You can't stop Marcus. You give Marcus a junkyard, he'll come out like Optimus Prime, bro. Yeah, I'm stabilized. That's it. That's it, bro. I'm breaking out. Straight out of hell, yo. I really gotta practice my button... Button layout. Because I feel like... I'm pressing the wrong buttons for the controls sometimes, and that's gonna get me killed at some point. Maybe not now, but one day, I'm gonna die to that. Oh, you wanna race? I think I'm winning. I think I'm winning, buddy. Oh, nah, never mind. I'm clinging for dear life, buddy. Alright, what's on the other side of this hell? I should have went to the gym before this. I'm all sore looking at something. What are you looking at? What the hell are you looking at? I have an optical unit. I should see. Let me see. Wait, take what? A knife? Oh, nah. Don't tell me there's other robots that I gotta fight. Rip off what? <laughs> oh, I'm ripping off the processor thing. Yo, I'm an agent gone rogue. Marcus gone rogue, buddy. And now I have my own conscience. I don't have to do what other people tell me to do. That's it, man. I'm free. And I look human. Oh, oh no. Oh no. So what's Marcus gonna be? He, he lost a loved one. He's free. He's not a slave. I think he's gonna be a, like an antagonist, or he's gonna rise. I think he's gonna rise and help cyborgs like take over. That composition where he walks away really makes him look like he's going down the path 
the path of like like darkness marcus came back from the dead that's an epic title all right let's go we're off to a good start already god damn we are off to a good start yo it's your agent amanda all right here's my suspicions because I'm, I'm the sherlock holmes of this game amanda's a rich girl something went down and now i gotta check this is a nice place amanda we got doves out here i think they're doves i don't, I don't want to look stupid why can't you have a normal walkway like normal human beings or androids whatever you are I'll, I'll scan you and understand are you an artist too that explains the excessive amount of space you need to live what's up amanda hello amanda oh she trusts me do we have a relationship Hannah, already it's good to see you yeah i've been around the neighborhood finding that deviant was far from easy hell yeah you tell you me about it great skill in your investigation they don't call me Connor the Badass for no could be reason. Unstable. Oh no! Nah. You should have been more cautious. I'm I thought sorry. I could make it talk. You're like my mentor. It was a judgment error. Never mind. You're I'm human. I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future. You're human, so I think you're my master. The interrogation seemed challenging. Oh, it was. What did you think of the deviant? Like he was stupid, honestly. Um, hmm. I think he was traumatized. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. Like he kept looking at me with a this wink. I don't know what that Lieutenant means. Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Oh, he's a little harsh, man. He's like, yeah, unpleasant, bro. I find him unpleasant and unprofessional. Yo, he's always drinking. He seems to have an addictive personality. Has a lack of respect for procedure and despises androids, yeah, he which does. makes our relationship difficult. Bro, he, he told me to stay in the car. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. We, so you're an android. What do you think is the best approach? You're an android. Uh, adapt. I will adapt to his personality. Do. That's all we can do, girl. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. Are you saying to kill Hank? More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. So what You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. I'm the chosen one. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. So why do you doubt me? You can me? count on me, Amanda. Why do you doubt me, Amanda? Adaption is the only way. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. For what? I just got here. What are we making? Cookies? Am I late for the cookies? Not the cookies. Oh, this is dope. Am I still Connor? Or am I like another agent? Yeah, I'm still Connor. Go to reception. Where's Hank? All right, I guess I don't have a choice. Oh, am I next? I'm sorry, I didn't notice you. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Uh, hell yeah. Yes. <laughs> I'm like his best friend, bro. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Thanks. Stupid androids. Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> Lieutenant Connor, you know what I do. You know what I do out here. Right. I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's desk. It, it's the ugly one. It's that desk right there. Oh, damn, it does look ugly. It looks more ugly in person. <laughs> I'm looking for my library card. Okay, never mind. This isn't a library. I guess you can't help me. Hey, what's up, guys? Oh. What, Officer Brown? What type of name is that? <laughs> I'm gonna get kicked out. I I'm taking over, guys. I'm taking over command. My name's Agent Connor. The android sent by Cyberlife to take all your jobs. <laughs> Why do you get promoted? For drinking? That's the only thing he's good at. And he's young? Whoa, whoa, hold up. Young? Lieutenant Anderson don't look that young. Japanese maple, I gotta look that up. I think that's for like good luck or something. There's always that last motherfucking clue. A hat, so what? Basketball, he likes basketball. Detroit basketball, gotta remember that. Detroit basketball. 
Oh, he's here. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. He hates me, bro. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hank! In my office. Oh, you tight, bro. <laughs> I've got ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. To be fair, we're I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Oh. Why do I gotta be the one to deal with this shit? He hates androids. I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. <laughs> Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! Hank, I'm... The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you left me holding the bag. Hank. Hank. Cyberlife sent over this Hank android six. to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hey, hey, I'm metal. Hank, you are seriously <laughs> starting to piss I'm 90%. me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my shut goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. <laughs> this conversation I, I, I is novel. over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. <laughs> why are you doing this to me? Hey. Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Oh. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Hank, I'll upload a new friendly personality. Maybe, maybe that will help him. Let me talk about Anderson. I wonder whether Lieutenant Anderson is really the best person for this investigation. Don't yell hey. at me. <laughs> I don't need a machine to tell me how to handle my men, okay? Yo. So get the fuck out of my office. Yo, this is why androids hate you. Have humans. a nice day, Captain. Yeah, kill him with kindness, Anderson. Uh, Connor. Kill him with kindness, Connor. You know how it is. Uh, check on Hank. Go see the Deviant. I'm gonna see the Deviant. You really think Hank wants to talk to me, bro? Oh, Marcus died. I like this. Very good for the news to just update. Very immersive. Oh, oh, I missed the lecture. How did... Capture Criminals 101. 32 units act. Oh, that's a nice map. That's that Google Maps 3.0. Hey, man. It's been a while. They're going to destroy me. Well, what'd you think was going to happen, little bitch? My objective was to capture you alive. Yeah, bro. What happens now is not my problem. Fuck out of here. I was trying to be on your side, and you didn't do shit. I'm on your side. I want to help you. Like I really do. I can do if you won't talk to me. Trust me, those guys wanna what? You you made me look bad, bro. I'm going to die. I know you are. <laughs> I'm a traitor, bro. Episode three. Episode three, man. Let's just hope you end up like Marcus and break out of it. <laughs> Open the cell, quick. Oh no. Nah. You trying to kill yourself? <laughs> He's trying to kill himself. Okay. I guess that handled that. 